on an island untouched by time. In a world divided by war, a stranger came into their lives. Is it true you don't have any musical training? I don't, no. And, you, and let, yet you learn how to play the mandolin? Yes, for the movie, yeah. Wow, yeah. that's really impressive. Well, it's, it is and it isn't because I just sort of went into a focus mode where I was just memorizing the four or five songs that they wanted me to play by rote. As soon as the movie was over, I forget it. I couldn't play anything. I put it down and it all left my head and that was the end of it. Yes, he learned very, very quick and he didn't play an instrument before. He also sings very well. He has a good, very good talent for music, I think. He, he worked, worked really hard. so hard on that. I mean, it, I really take my hat off to him. It was very impressive. Because it made all the difference to the scenes we played, with the, the way the mandolin was uh, used and was important. And, uh, you know, it, it's, it's in the title, too. So it's, uh, it's got to play a part. And he made it play a part. And I, you know, I really, I, th I found Nick very impressive to work with. I think my character had that first love with Mandras when you haven't had anything else, so you think that's the one. Mm -hmm. But they are so different, those two people, no? That then she realized that, that he's not, and it takes her a time to admit it because she loves him she, in another way, like a friend, like a cousin, like the, someone she grew up with, no? But then she meets the one later. When it's over, you will come back to me. Romance is, in a lot of ways, impossible at that time, but yet he confesses, you know, his feelings for her. I don't think he was being careful. I think he was sort of going against, it was sort of like, damn it all, I, I love you, I don't care what the world thinks, you know, that sort of overly passionate man. Is that a very Nicolas Cage thing to do, too? Sure. <laughs> yeah. She gets angry about those things, his behavior in the world, how can be singing and eating with his friends, and, but she also admires that in him. She cannot accept, accept it in his face, but that's what she loves about him too. You've done uh, quite a few romances. Um, how good were you at wooing women when you were younger? Oh, no, I, wasn't, I wasn't any good at that. I was a total nerd. <laughs> what sorts of things did you do to I, try? Uh, you know, my, my thing is, is that I was just too romantic. I was the, I was the romantic goofball. I mean, I was... I didn't, I wasn't cynical enough. I, I cared too much, you know, so I always made a fool out of myself. Do you get your heart broken a lot then? Oh yeah, oh god, yeah, yeah. So this yeah. must be a nice vicarious way of living to do these roles where you get the girl and oh. you get to do all. Yeah, yeah, it is, it, it is nice. It's, uh, I like love stories, you know, I always have. I've always responded to that and maybe one day I'll direct one. Mm -hmm.